Alrighty, welcome to what I believe is the finale of Little Nightmares 2. We're here with Mono in the hallway once again. And we're basically like a god now, so I'm just gonna go do whatever the hell I want. <laughs> but uh, anyway, uh, before we head in through the eyeball door once again, I would really appreciate if you leave a like on the video and subscribe to the channel as it helps us out a lot. Now, let's see what is behind the door once more. Whee! It's not all staticky and chaotic. It's actually kind of peaceful in a weird way. Also, the, the main theme is subtly playing in the background. Do, do, do. Oh, the door's opening by itself. Whoa. Cool. This is like, uh, in, uh, spoilers for Half Life Alex, the, uh, the end of it is just like this. Like you're going through different houses and or different homes and things are just floating around. Very similar. Cool. That is so awesome. Do do do. Oh. Okay, did not want us to go in there. We go this way instead. Oh! Cool. I have like a million thoughts going through. I just, I'm not saying anything because I just want to listen. Whoa, look at how stretched out and distorted this dresser is. Oh, do we have to follow? We have to follow the music. Okay, I see. Oh, oh there's my shadow. <laughs> cool. I love it when games get all trippy like this. Nope, not you. Looks like it's you. Is it this one? Yeah, okay. I was like, I don't know if there's another option, but it didn't sound as loud. Whoa. So cool. Like I feel like this is something that could like put you to sleep. <laughs> like I said, in a weird way, it's like peaceful. Okay, this is the same room. No, it's not that one. Not that one. It's gotta be this one then. Yep. Come on, you got it. Oh, do I got it? Okay, that's not working. Oh, is it a handle? No. Oh, wait, do I have to push this one open over here? Oh, uh, well that's not near enough. I don't want to actually go through this though. Well, no, it's still not really... Oh, there we go. I just had to do it for a tad bit longer. I just, I didn't want to go through the doorway, because I knew it was wrong. Not this one. 
Not that one. This is so, like, ethereal. Lucky guess. Oh. Oh, snap. I should have pushed that over before I came over here. Uh, well, what now? Okay. I just had to backtrack. Push this over first. Okay. Now we can go over there. Oh. Easy does her. Climbing up in the world. Hills. I just want to see if this is like secrets or something. Oh, no. Okay. Tis nothing. Whoa. Oh, it's Six's uh, music box. That makes sense. I also hear... <gasps> oh my god, six! No! Oh, what happened to you? Damn. You're one of the monsters now. All stretched out of proportion. Oh no. It's okay, I'm not gonna touch it. Uh, what do I do? Why do- oh. Oh my gosh. Your arm has, like, th three different joints. Oh, man. That is so unfortunate. What? There's a... No. Are you gonna make me hit the music box? Why? I don't want to do that. Oh... Oh! Yeah, okay, I just did it wrong. Oh, what am I about- what am I doing? What am I doing? Oh! Oh, the building's collapsing! Oh, and Six is mad! Six is mad! Okay, yeah, yeah, rightfully so! I'm sorry! I didn't- I didn't want to do it! Oh my gosh! Oh, my own friend is after me! I didn't mean it! Oh, Jesus! Oh! Hide! Oh my gosh! This is crazy. I also noticed too, like, when the walls were collapsing, there was like... Flesh. <laughs> like, it was weird. I just, I wasn't focused on it that much. It's like this whole tower is a monster of its own. Oh, man. 
I'm doing too much here. Oh. Okay, easy, easy, easy. I'm just gonna, just... I'm just gonna go this way. I'm not gonna touch it. Oh. Oh! Oh, okay, I understand. Okay, I'm gonna have to... The game is making me... Hit the music box again. I, I see what I have to do now. Yeah, okay. Oh! I didn't get there in time. done we're just we're just making this whole thing worse for ourselves <laughs> oh goodness oh we stayed here this time six oh my god we're we're just it just keeps going we're in purgatory also I realize when I do that too I kind of like leave a glitchy element behind. Weird. That's so cool. Oh, okay, we're back already. Ew, yeah, look at look at the walls. They're like it's like flesh. Oh, that's so weird. Okay, what do we? What's the play here? So there's uh, two over there as well. The axe is right here. Okay, I think I, I think I got it. So we. Oh no, that's not right. Wait. Oh, we got to do it from this side. Like that. Okay, then I think we gotta have her come this way. Yeah, okay. Got it. Oh, we're back here again. <laughs> okay, I guess we gotta find uh, another door. Oh, no. Oh. Well, that didn't take very long. Okay. Now what? Okay, so there's a path over there, and that's where the axe is. So I call here first, then I go over there, get the axe. And then I have to... Okay, then I have to just do it the... I basically just have to do it the opposite way. I think. Let's try it. Ooh, come on! Come on! Oh! Just caught us there at the end. Okay, we gotta be a little quicker. Okay. Woo. Okay, now we're good. Uh. Oh, okay. Then we gotta have her come back this way so we can go around. Okay, I got it. I got it. Yep. There we go. Perfect. And douche. Oh my goodness. We 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 are really doing it too, man. Oh, goodness. 
The music's starting to falter. Oh, that is so menacing looking. Six, I am so sorry. All she wants is her music box, man. And we're ruining it. Oh. Oh, man. Okay. This is it. Oh, man. Oh! You're back to normal! It was the music box all along. Oh, the walls are disgusting. At least you're back to normal now. Oh god. Okay, it's time to move. Ew, there's an eye on the fucking... Oh, this has got to be like a person with claustrophobia's like worst nightmare. No pun intended. Ew! <laughs> so good. Oh. Oh. Was I supposed to actually wait a little bit there? Okay. Oh, I see. Okay. Oh, just keep going. Oof! Come on! Oh my god, this place is actually just coming apart. Falling apart, I mean. Oh, yes, TV. Douche. Come on, pull me up. Wait. Six? Pull me up. What? Six? After all that... Huh. I mean, yeah, I know, I did destroy your music box. I'm sorry, but... Damn. Oh, where are we? Are we in, like, the belly of the beast? Multiple eyeballs looking at me. What in the hell? Oh gosh. Oh no.
Damn. I'm taller, like way taller. No way. Am I the fucking TV man? Or another version of him? Like the next TV man? Holy shit. That's crazy. So it's just like a continuous cycle then? And then yeah, there, there, there's the room. Now someone now someone else has to let him out. Uh, uh, whether it's the same character like Mono again or it's someone else, I don't know. But yeah, that makes a lot more sense why Mono has very similar powers. Cause Mono is him. Damn. Man. Hats off to the people at Tarzir. This was incredible. Huge step up. And the first game was good too. Like, there were some mechanics and stuff that were a little more wonky and stuff like that but it was still a very good story and it was a little shorter too because you're just playing as six on the maw but yeah the scale of everything on this one is stepped up to a whole nother level the actual uh style of art it, it's the same sort of style as the first one but it just plays into it even better here The atmosphere, the soundtracks are, oh, they are so good. Just chef's kiss, just mwah. They blend in so well with each tense scenario, whether it's just with like the sub characters or the actual main enemies that you're dealing with, or even when you're not dealing with them, like you're just in an, an area with nothing going on, but it's just dark and tense. Like, your mind and imagination is doing way, a lot more of the work. So, so good. But yeah, and then that's, that's the reason why we don't see anything regarding Mono afterwards. Because, yeah, he just constantly goes through the same loop. And maybe that's why he's called Mono, because... He just has one life, and that's that's all it is. Huh. And then, yeah, this is probably where Six develops that uh, dark side. Or 
where she starts consuming everything. I don't know. Damn. I feel so bad for Mono. He was just trying to help. But yeah, man. That was by far one of the better, the best, nah, what was say, we'll correct that, best horror games that I've played through. And it's, again, it's not like horror in the sense of jump scare, ooh, ah. It's much more like unnerving and tension building and stuff like that. Like it, it does so well playing into other fears, such as like yeah, I, I forget the one that's, uh, the, I forget the phobia that's like for the dark. But the one that when you're you're afraid of the dark or like claustrophobia, especially like at the end there where the walls are like closing in. And they're, it's all like fleshy and gloopy and there's eyes watching you as it happens. Like it's, it's so good. Everything meshes together beautifully in this game. They, they get, they, every now and then there are still a little... There's a little bit of wonkiness in the controls and uh, sometimes I might get stuck on a little corner or a wall or something. Um, or sometimes I don't grab onto something right away. But again, Half that time was also just me pushing the wrong buttons and being an idiot, <laughs> not knowing what I'm doing. Um, so that it, it is what it is. But uh, no, it, for for sure, this game is beautifully crafted. Absolutely recommend playing this. And yeah, I'll have to sit here and kind of think about it and uh, also watch some more videos on it to understand the lore a little bit better as there was a lot that was dumped on us there at the end. But, uh, yeah, very interesting stories with these two characters. And, uh, I do, I do know there is a third game that is, uh, coming out next year. It's not by Tarzir, though. It's primarily by, uh, Supermassive. Supermassive enhanced this one for PC, but then I think they just took over and made the third game. So... I am curious to see how that turns out, but uh, yeah, it seems like the story with Mono and Six are pretty much done. Unless, for whatever reason, they either decide to come back or whatever happens with them in the future, I don't know. But yeah, that's going to do it for Little Nightmares 2. Hope you guys enjoyed the series. If you did, leave a like on the video and subscribe to the channel. And I will see you guys back in Most Wanted.